The objective of this video is to define the p-value. A researcher believes that the mean age of medical doctors in a large hospital system is older than the average age of doctors in the United States, which is 46. Assume the population standard deviation is 4.2 years. A random sample of 30 doctors from the system is selected and the mean age of the sample is 48.6. Find the probability that the sample of 30 doctors would have a mean age of 48.6 years or older. Since the sample size is at least 30, we can apply the central limit theorem. So we will begin by calculating the z-score associated with the sample mean. So we will substitute the sample mean, population mean, population standard deviation, and sample size into the formula. This will result in a z-score of 3.39. The area under the standard normal distribution to the right of z equal to 3.39 is 0 0.0003. So using probability notation, we can write the probability that z would equal or exceed 3.39 would be 0 0.0003. The p-value is the probability of getting a sample statistic or a more extreme sample statistic in the direction of the alternative hypothesis when the null hypothesis is true. The belief is that the mean age of medical doctors in a large hospital system is older than the average age of doctors in the United States, which is 46. So let's state the hypotheses for this situation. The null hypothesis would be that the population mean is equal to 46. The alternative hypothesis would be that the population mean is greater than 46. The claim would be in the alternative hypothesis in this case. Now let's relabel the curve in the context of the problem. That means that the population mean would be 46. The sample mean, x bar, is 48.6. Then we can state our probability as the probability that the sample mean would be equal to or exceed 48.6 is 0 0.0003. So the probability of getting this sample statistic or a more extreme sample statistic in the direction of the alternative hypothesis, assuming this null hypothesis is true, would be 0 0.0003. Therefore, the p-value would be 0 0.0003. So this probability, or in other words, the area under the curve in the tail to the right of the sample mean, which is in the direction of the alternative hypothesis, would be the p-value. In this video, we defined the p-value. 